one of the most groundbreaking research papers that has recently made a significant impact in the field of AI, is focused on the drag your gain which a generative adversarial network model. While diffusion models have gained attention for generating images by starting with noise and gradually removing it, gain offer a different approach because here, the computer attempts to generate an image and then evaluates whether it appears real or fake. This method involves manipulating a starting image, such as a cat, by making gradual adjustments to specific features, like the cat's nose. As the nose is moved, the rest of the cat's body adapts slowly and smoothly to maintain overall coherence with the new changes. This technique ensures that the modified image remains visually consistent throughout the transformation process. In the case of a lion, this method allows for dragging the nose of the lion image from one location to another. As the nose is moved, the image is dynamically adjusted to reflect the new position, ensuring a smooth transition. Notably, the rest of the lion's body also undergoes coherent changes to maintain the overall appearance of the image. The method intelligently adjusts the entire image to ensure that it consistently resembles the intended subject throughout the manipulation process. Here's an example where the method is applied to a car image, allowing for adjustments such as resizing, repositioning, or changing its orientation. The entire image is intelligently modified to maintain coherence. Similar transformations can be observed in other examples, such as separating the legs of a horse moving the face of a cat, or even altering facial features of a person like making them smile, make her look her face look thinner, move her bangs up just to just her right eye or her left eye, make the shorts longer, move the feet, move the sleeves. There's just so much crazy stuff that you can do with this technology. Adjusting cheeks or making their face appear thinner. This technology has immense potential and could potentially replace traditional software like Photoshop in the future. By starting with a single image and dragging it around, users can achieve their desired outcome. Although the technology is not currently available for general use, the code is expected to be released in June, and it is likely that Photoshop plugins and other tools will incorporate this functionality into their workflows, allowing users to manipulate images in such a remarkable manner. This process continues iteratively until the computer can no longer distinguish between real and fake images. While this explanation is simplified, delving into further detail would require more time. This innovative technique demonstrates that gain models have a more significant impact beyond the visually impressive images generated by diffusion models like DALI-2. Stable Diffusion and Mid-Journey Gain employs a two-network system comprising a generator and a discriminator, leveraging their adversarial nature to produce new and synthesized data instances. In contrast, diffusion models are likelihood-based models that offer enhanced stability and higher quality results for image generation tasks. The practical applications of gain models are particularly noteworthy. Social media users, for example, may desire to modify various aspects of a person or animal in a casual photograph, such as their location, shape, expression, or body pose. In the realm of expert media editing and movie pre-visualization, there may be a need to quickly sketch out scenes with specific layouts. Additionally, car designers might benefit from interactive shape alterations for their designs. The versatility and interactive nature of gain models make them well-suited for a range of real-world applications beyond traditional image generation.